Hello everybody, so welcome back to another video. I'm going to show you how to actually put the thread on your bobbin, okay? So we're going to put this here for the second. If your thread, if your machine is still threaded for the upper enable, take that out. And we're going to come over here to where this little spinny thing is, if you have the brother uh, LX3125, okay? We're going to take the thread and we are going to wrap it around twice, okay? So take it and wrap around once and wrap around again. It makes it a little tighter because it seems to come out if you don't do it twice, okay? Then I'm going to take the end of this thread. I have a bobbin that has holes in it. Yours might not exactly be like that. Um, but if you have this one or something close to it, take and pull the thread up through the hole. Put that on the little bobbin spindle. We're going to push it this way. That stops the needle from moving up and down, okay? Then you're going to take it and turn the machine on. So I got my machine on. If your thread is a little loose like this, then just kind of hold it tight and hold this area also while you're slowly pressing on the foot. Kind of move the thread up and down to simulate the same thing it's going to do by itself. And it should pick up and start by itself. And that's how you do it. Once the thing gets full, or, or probably about 90% full, then you're going to snip it. You're going to move this back over, take this off. The little piece of thread that you were holding that you pulled up through the top of the bobbin, bobbin snip that. And then watch the other video on how to actually put it inside of a bobbin case if you have a bobbin case. And that's it. Hey there, thanks for watching my little sewing video on how to put the thread on that bobbin <laughs> with your sewing machine. Um, if you like this video, click the little like button below and uh, click my right hand to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss out on future videos. And if you have any sewing or pattern making questions or challenges, um, click my left hand and that'll take you to a screen where you can actually submit your questions and get a free ebook download for me in your email. Um, I look through these questions whenever I have to come up with a new idea for a video. So I might actually choose your question for a future video. Uh, thanks and see you around.